Now to the big picture. The U.S. mainland, given the staggering volume of mail-in ballots this year, it may be days before we know who won the presidential election, depending on which dates declare early tomorrow or maybe not for days. Kimberly Speakman continues our coverage. We might have to wait for the national races, but here at home, we'll have new faces in leadership roles. KHON 2's political analyst tells me for many of these races, it'll all come down to their campaign. It will be a new mayor, a new city council, at a hugely pivotal moment in our history. Rick Blangiardi and Keith Amemiya are both political newcomers who haven't held office yet. Dr. John Hart says their campaign message will play a key role in winning the election. In terms of the mayor's race, uh, most of the polls indicate that Blangiardi is ahead. However, Amemiya's people have an internal poll that say it's much closer. We really don't have policy paths to look at. So this is going to be more of a, a ethos or character credibility uh, race on who do you feel more comfortable with. As for the Big Island mayoral race between Mitch Roth and Ikaika Marzo, Hart says it'll be up to the people to decide who will best lead the county. You have someone who's more of a traditional, uh, uh, we might say, establishment candidate, but with a good record, versus someone who's more of a community activist. He also says polls for Honolulu prosecuting attorney indicate Steve Alm is leading over Megan Cow, but that can change. And while Hart says Hawaii will likely know who won after the first and second printout, the presidential race could take days to learn the final outcome. A lot of the battleground states are within the margin of errors, meaning even if polling is correct, it's within 4%. Anything you see within 4%, you cannot legitimately call. And could there be a shift in power in Congress? Hart says that depends on who states pick for president. These ballots are going to go top down. In mm -hmm. other words, a lot of people that vote for the Republican president will vote for the Republican senator. Same for the Democrats. Hart says candidates will be campaigning up until the very last minute, and votes made tomorrow could make a difference. Kimberly Speakman, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii. KHON2 is your local election headquarters. Our coverage of the general election will start at 2 p.m. tomorrow with the first Hawaii results at 7 p.m. on KHON2, our sister station, KHI, and KHON2.com.